Hey singers, it's Justin Stoney, the founder of New York Vocal Coaching, joining you for another episode of Quick Singing Tips. Today we're hanging out at the Metropolitan Museum of Art. The Met is the largest art museum in the U.S. and is home to so much artistic glory that it staggers the mind. We're here today because of a question from Emmanuel F. in Avignon, France. Emmanuel writes, Dear Justin, what is chiaroscuro and how can it make me a great singer? That's a bright question, Emmanuel. Chiaroscuro is a very important term for singers to know because chiaroscuro is in many ways the ideal tone quality of a singing voice. Do you want to have a voice that sounds pure, pleasing, and balanced? Of course you do. Well, then you need chiaroscuro. I employed some chiaroscuro shading. Let's explore what it is. Chiaroscuro is an Italian word that means bright, dark. The term comes from the Italian Renaissance. The great Italian painters of this period would combine elements of bright and dark in their artwork. The combination was so beautiful, beautiful. that art aficionados would exclaim, Mamma mia, chiaroscuro, the perfect blend of bright and dark. Now let me tell you, I have tasted and I have seen there's a lot of awesome chiaroscuro going on at the Met. But Justin, what does all this have to do with singing? Well, not long after the Italian Renaissance, the famous Italian school of singing came around. And the Italians noted that the same thing is true of a voice as it is of a painting. You don't want too much bright or too much dark in a voice. Instead, it's the combination of the two that makes a voice balanced. In other words, if all I do is chiaro, then an Italian person is gonna say, mi ha rotto il timpano. And if all I do is oscuro, se ben crudele mi fa il then an Italian person is gonna say, che brutto. But finally, if I put the two together, I get chiaroscuro. Se ben crudele mi fai languir. And I hope an Italian person would say, che bella voce, Justin. Ah, grazie. Now, sometimes folks believe that chiaroscuro only applies to classical singing, but that's a mistake, actually. In reality, all voices in all styles can benefit from this concept. Being able to consciously make adjustments to the brightness or darkness of your voice is one of the core skills you need for vocal mastery in any style. So let's explore. Here are things that can contribute to a brighter sound. Forward tongue, spread embouchure, lifted larynx, twang, compressed vocal folds. Now here are some things that contribute to a darker sound. Retracted tongue position, rounded embouchure, lowered larynx, and decompressed vocal folds. We've talked about all of these things in past episodes of Voice Lessons to the World and Quick Singing Tips. So we know that some of these things shouldn't be taken to extremes, but truthfully, none of these things are necessarily good or bad, right or wrong. They're just many things that the voice can do. They're like colors on an artist's palette. And ultimately for you as a vocal artist, I want you to have the ability to use just a little bit of this color or just a little bit of that color. And today we're gonna to start practicing with a chiaroscuro vocal exercise. In today's exercise, you get a chance to experiment with many different colors of your voice and start to achieve a chiaroscuro balance. I'm gonna do a simple ma 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 like this. Ma 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 ma. But we're gonna do it in three different ways. First, chiaro. Ma 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 ma. Then oscuro. Ma 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 ma. Then balanced. 
ma 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 ma. Feel free to combine many different elements of bright and dark as you exaggerate the first two rounds. But then make sure on round three you're going for your most balanced sound. Got it? Let's try it. Guys will be down here. Ma 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 ma. And ladies will be up here. Ma 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 ma. And here we go. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. That's it. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Got it. Bright. Good. Dark. Yes. Balanced. You did it. And bright. Mm hmm. Dark. Mm hmm. Balanced. Excellent. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. You did it. Bright. Mm hmm. Dark. Yes. Balanced. Beautiful. Come down. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. You're doing it. Chiaro. Oscuro. Chiaro oscuro. Yes. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. That's it. Two more. Mm hmm. Dark and balanced. Last one. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Ma 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 ma. Woo! Yes, that's awesome. You've really explored the many colors of your voice. Excellent. Here are some more things that I hope make your vocal journey a little more colorful. For voice lessons or Skype lessons with the NYVC staff, visit us at NewYorkVocalCoaching.com. If you'd like a vocal course that you can do at home, check out the Voice Lessons to the World Vocal Course. This 12-part program takes you on a singing journey from beginner to master level vocal exercises. You can find it at VoiceLessonsToTheWorld.com. Or if you'd like free vocal tips sent to you each day, sign up at DailyVocalTips.com. And now, here's Justin with this week's Vocal Benediction. Our lives and our vocal journeys are always going to be a mixture of sunshine and shade. But the mistake is to get too giddy in the bright seasons and too frustrated in the dark seasons. Really, it's wiser to take a step back and look at what God is doing on the entire artistic canvas of your life. If you do, then you'll see that regardless of whether it's a season of victory or a season of setbacks, your life can be a masterpiece.